several area games and all the scores on tonight's scoreboard. One of the featured matchups of the night has the Walsh Warriors paying a visit to Paul Brown Tiger Stadium to face the Maslin Tigers. Mike Cates takes a look at a very talented Walsh team. It has been three years since Walsh's last playoff appearance, and getting a postseason bid this year will not be an easy task. The Warriors have the toughest schedule in their history and one of the toughest in the state. There's, there's no doubt it's the toughest schedule we've ever had here at Walsh High School. Um, there's, there's state playoff uh, champs, there's state playoff uh, contenders uh, or championship contenders, and most of the other teams get in the playoffs usually on a pretty regular basis, so it's, it's a demanding one. With such a rough road ahead of these guys, the team feels there's only one way to be successful. Really a good team unity. Everybody gets along real well and picks each other up. I think that's key for us. Walsh's strength again this year will be the defense. It's a group that has eight starters back from a year ago, and they shut down a powerful Erie McDowell team in the second half last week to preserve the victory. We are moving quick. We got a real quick defense. And uh, everybody, everybody's back from last year, so they, everybody knows what it takes to win. So we got that going for us. The only problem could be on the other side of the football when the Warriors face big teams like Mentor Lake Catholic, St. Vincent St. Mary, or this week's test, Maslin. Maslin's huge, but uh, I tell you, you know, the team we played last week from Miri, uh, they were awful big, too. Uh, we're, we're, we've known we're going to be a little bit undersized this year, and we're just going to have to get it done with quickness. Even if they're outsized and in a hostile environment, Walsh appears pretty confident. I don't think anybody thinks we're going to lose in this game. I mean, we're not underestimating them, but we know we got the talent to do it, and we shouldn't lose this game. We'll see you on Friday. Kickoff at Paul Brown Stadium is at 730. Mike Case, 23 Newsday, Walsh High School.